Hello, this is Stampy Longnose, and welcome to another Minecraft gameplay commentary. And as you can see here, my collection of dogs is continually growing. I now own eight dogs. And let me just get them all to stand up. Normally I just leave them all sitting here um, to keep them out of the way, because having eight dogs following you around can be kind of mental. Oh, he's up anyway. Yeah, so um, this, this is what I've got following me around at the moment. This is Stampy's wolf pack and uh, I'm the leader of the wolf pack and it is absolutely hilarious and I'll go and show you why. Um, one, I feel very safe, you know? Like, I'm always scared that one of the dogs are gonna die. Is that a new one? I oh, know, that, that's, woo! And they always teleport at me and kind of scare me. All right, see if I can find an animal. There's another one around here. Oh wait, well when I see a sheep or something, I'm gonna just send them on it and like the entire pack just charge them down and it's hilarious. Oh, here's a cow, I think. Nope, that's a box. Right, so what I'm going to be doing in this video, I'm going to be finishing- Oh yeah, I haven't even shown you this. Ta-da! This is the star of Stampy's lovely garden. No, sorry, Stampy's love garden. Uh, this heart gra graciously donated by Crimson Azov. And uh, this is the place I've decided to put the um, all the signs. So uh, if you don't know, leave a comment below just saying your name or preferably like a funny message or a nickname. And uh, I'll put a sign up and you see I've put a few up. I've got Crimson Azov, uh, Afro Dan, i got the Jackal. Uh, I got oh, these dogs are driving me crazy. I got Wind Harmony, uh, J Bay Gameplay. I have FX Navarro. I can't pronounce his name very well. He's a very long term subscriber, watches a lot of my videos. Uh, Ank, who's actually been in a few of my videos. Uh, Agentical 117. Agent Cool 117, even. Uh, Raven Jack 49. And Littlewood on the end. And so, yeah, these are people that have um, commented before. Uh, if you have commented asking to be in a sign and you're furious because uh, your sign is not yet added, it's because there's like, I kind of stockpile these videos a bit. So, like. Um, if you've commented between here and now, the chances are uh, you haven't actually commented yet at the time I'm making this video. So yeah, I will be adding everyone eventually. And these are all spaces. These rows are going to be where I'm going to be putting more signs in the future. So I'm being ambitious. I'm hoping that I get quite a lot of you adding. And this isn't some ploy to get loads of comments because having more comments doesn't help the video or anything whatsoever. I just want to say that if you want to be in the video, then you can. But I just want to show you this quick. Uh, this is Stampy's first shelter. And I've just realised... Uh, the other day that this is where I was in the very first video I uploaded if you saw it when I build my very first house I'm here digging away and all these gaps the stuff that I dug on my very first day in Minecraft and I kind of swam uh, along that cliff and I sort of dug in around about there and that's where I got coal so if you did see the first video it's kind of weird that out of this entire massive Minecraft world um, this is where I spent my very first night and this is where I've kind of decided to build my permanent home I would show you down there but these dogs are driving me <laughs> crazy, but oh well. So yeah, I'm going to get on with building the rest of this garden, which won't take long, so I'm not going to bother adding any signs in this video. Then I will move around here as long as I have time and start building here. And this is going to be my kind of farm area. You can see I've already, I've, I've done a little start on it and kind of done a few holes to plot out where I'm going to build stuff. But yeah, I'm going to build this farm. I say build this farm. I'm going to plant this farm uh, in this video. <laughs> See if I can get these all wet so they will start shaking each other. Shaking each other, shaking themselves. Here we go. Man, none of them are drying themselves off. <laughs> there they go. Oh, they do it all at the same time, synchronized. Like synchronized swimming. Yeah, and then if I have time after that, it's going to be a busy video. I'm going to try and get the last few achievements, which I haven't yet got, which will be... Uh, there's only a few. Um, there's four I haven't get, but there's one I can't get this video. I'm going to try and get the lie, uh, reference to portal there. Uh, bake a cake using wheat sugar, milk and eggs. I'm going to have a delicious fish. I'm going to catch a cook, catch a cook, catch a fish and cook it. I can't do that um, achievement in this video, but I will do that in Crim City, my friend's world. Uh, he's already got a cart, which is that long. And then I'm going to ride a saddle and hope that the pig gets hurt because you can ride pigs and you can't actually control where they go. So to get that achievement, you kind of got to get a bit lucky. But right, first things first, I'm going to sort of make this even. I've kind of done one side, so I sort of know what I'm doing. The thing that is really annoying is, well, I'm going to smack these dogs. Oh, my God. <laughs> Boys, over it. Come on. Everyone go this side of the garden. Now, if I quickly run, I should be able to do it. I <laughs> oh, I didn't think this through. I feel like, oh, more, the more the merrier, but I don't think that's the case. Oh. I've hit one already. Good thing is they don't attack you when you hit them, but you just feel really guilty. 
<laughs> this is this is ridiculous. Oh, I think my biggest hindrance in building is going to be all the dogs getting in the way. Right, come on out of the way. Come on, get out. Get out. There we go. Oh, I miss Gregory. Gregory, I mean, he seemed like a nuisance at the time when you'd get in the way, but it's nothing like this. And uh, also remember that if you want to name one of my dogs, seen as my collection's growing, uh, leave a comment. And the top rated comments, or either just the first comments, or if it's just a name I really like, uh, I will name a dog after you, or after your suggestion. Um, it's going to be very difficult to uh, <laughs> to remember which dog is which, seeing as they are all actually clones. So, Oh well. Oh my god, this is crazy. So yeah, this is basically what the garden's going to be. So there's going to be rows of signs along here with people's names. And these wooden planks are basically just the like the paths, basically. You imagine signs where all these lines of grass are. And yeah, I don't think there's much else to do. I could add a few roses here, I guess. Best way to get roses, I found, is um uh, using bone meal. If you just throw bone meal down on the floor, um, it'll make a load of just plants just appear there It'll make like mainly long grass but you also get a few flowers and stuff that appear there as well and i found that that is the best way actually if i have these here people are going to trample on them what i might actually do is kill all the dogs and then after that add like a path bit here so it all kind of connects together yeah, like this <laughs> uh, which dog's gonna die first which dog's gonna die first I might seem very uncompassionate to my dogs, but when they're this frustrated... <laughs> oh my god. Alright, here we go. <laughs> when you when you press uh, left trigger, you tell them to sit, so constantly as I'm trying to place these blocks, the dogs are just sitting there. Right, right. I'm tempted just to go dump them all in my living room. Normally they're just all sitting, sitting down in my living room, and I kind of... They're only a nuisance when I'm going to pick up items or put things down and I kind of have to walk through a maze of them. They all start barking at me and whimpering. But I've never really gone out and about with them. So this is my first time doing that. See, I'm still old school. and you, I still mainly use stone tools, to be honest. I mean, I got a diamond pickaxe, but I usually save that for special occasions. On, on the day-to-day, -day, I just use stone because I feel like diamond and... Uh, iron and that I could kind of save to use for something else saying that there's not actually many uses for diamond It makes it makes the best tools, but apart from that there's not much you can do with it I mean you can make a jukebox with it, but um jukeboxes don't actually work at the moment uh, To have a jukebox work you need to put in like a CD like a music CD But they're not actually in the game yet. They're gonna be like updated later on which is kind of useless I'll probably continue this path later on, but I might do that once my dogs are all out the way somewhere I mean, I complain about the dogs. I know the second I see a new one, I'm going to add them. Right, so the reason I've got this row of water is to plant sugarcane there. Because sugarcane can only be placed uh, directly next to water. So I'm going to have two streams of water, which will go along here. And then down into a little waterfall. And there's no reason for the waterfall. It could just be a little stream, but I kind of like the waterfall. It looks pretty. So yeah, I just, all you have to do to plant, I just have to place it in a row and it will just grow from that area. I do actually have another little place where I've been getting uh, sugar cane for the moment. I'm going to leave it there. Just, it just looks pretty. Just down there, I got my little area of sugar cane. And there's a little door there to get into my mine. Also, if you saw the last video in which I went into the nether for the first time, I've been in there since. And I found another type of sand, which, if I remember, I'll show you in a second, called soul sand. And uh, it looks really cool. It's kind of a bit swirly and mystical looking. But it basically means that... Whenever anything walks on it, it slows it down, which, um, not by a huge amount, but it could be handy for, like, defending your house, I guess, if there's, like, zombies and that coming in. If you put soul sand there, it will slow them all down, but then again, it will slow you down as well. But you could kind of combine it with a, um, with a dispenser that dispenses arrow, arrows, and use it to kind of, like, fire arrows at people as they come. Right, see I've been very prepared this video and I've collected a whole load of buckets of water and I'm going to just dump it all in. Like you only need a few buckets to be honest but I try to like make things look even so you'll see as I place it, uh, it kind of, it looks a bit bumpy like if I put one there you'll see like a bump so I try and fill it all in but I did realise it's just starting to get dark so I am going to now go and leg it to my bed. Is that a wild dog? Oh, there's just dogs everywhere. Oh my god. Come on. 
I will build dog houses soon. I'm going to build a massive row of dog houses for all my dogs. Right, fuck it. I'm not waiting for them all to come in because I'll be here all day. It'll be a good test of my memory as well once they're all named, if I can remember all their names. I feel like Santa Claus with his reindeers. Like Prancer, like Glancer, Wanser, whatever their names are. Like Rudolph. Like, <laughs> like doing like a roll call every time I go to bed. Just check their numbers. Oh, here's one. Oh, they're, they're joining me. They protected me all night. Good boys. Right. I couldn't even trap them in like that. You've got to make them sit down. Because even if you do trap them inside, they just fly at you. Like you'll see one coming. There they go. Ah, I love my little garden. And I just used redstone torches for most of it rather than normal torches. Because I got a few torches to actually light it. But I used redstone just because it's a bit more atmospheric. It's a very kind of reddy, pinky uh, kind of garden. Right, I need to get rid of the end of here so I can have my little waterfall. I'm scared one of these dogs are going to push me down. Traumatic memories of Gregory pushing me down cliffs. Right, I wonder if any of the dogs will get taken in the slipstream and fall down. That'd be kind of funny. Oh, 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 is, is he going? Is he going? Is he going? Oh, is he going? Oh, he's gone. It was the water that pushed him down, not me. Oh, one of them's after me now. They're, they're not as loyal to me as I thought. They're sticking together. I can't get out. There we go. All right. Yes, I mean, I mean, this is fine as it is. I could plant, but I don't like it with its, like, kind of wavy like that. It looks a bit unrealistic, and I'm not going to do it now because I'd have to go and fetch a load more water. But if I do something like that, it kind of just makes it look a bit more level. You see how this one, in, this one is? It looks a bit more level. This one looks a bit weird. So as I say, it doesn't matter for now. I'm not going to worry about it, but that's, that's just personal preference for me. As I said in a past video, I like things to look natural. If ever, like, something's just floating in the sky or seems impossible and I don't really like it. Alright, there's the, the sugar cane planted. I've actually got a load more sugar cane inside, so I can do that, that last section. Also got a, uh, a random crafting crate here just because to craft stuff I couldn't be asked to keep going back inside. Okay, so now I'm going to have uh, a row of cactuses here. There's basically three things I believe you can grow. I mean, there's more types of plants. There's things like mushrooms and uh, like flowers and stuff, but and pumpkins. But in terms of the things you can plant and grow, I believe in this version, and I might be wrong, uh, I believe there's cactuses, sugar canes, and uh, wheat. And wheat being the main one and the most useful one, but I kind of might as well grow everything here. So I'm going to have two rows of wheat here and this is going to be a row of cacti and you don't get cacti in every level and um, i think yeah they, they need like two blocks and uh, i think that oh god my dogs are getting hurt oh they're all getting prickled oh stay away from there stay oh okay they're all gonna die aren't they from cactuses the most oh, right <laughs> oh, no <laughs> right on the nozzle oh, come on come over here come on come on i can just hear them whimpering they don't learn do they they don't learn Right, come on, I'm going to dump all of my dogs in here. Because this is what I've been pretty much doing the whole time. Actually, I might bring them into this room because they get in the way of it, this room. Right, everyone here. Roll call, roll call. Right, come on, who got hurt? If you got hurt, hold up your paw. This guy looks a bit hurt. I'll give him a pork chop. Right, sit. 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 Anyone else? Any other dogs can tell you? Oh, there he is, this dark silhouette. <laughs> I can see you. If I do it like that, it looks like one massive dog. Oh, he turned around. Wait, see if he turns back around. Dog, turn. This way. This way. I'll try and distract him with something. Make him turn. Oh. Oh, God. And he's here. Yeah, sorry. It looked like kind of like one long dog. <laughs> What's he doing? He really doesn't want to, like, stay in here, does he? Right, you can sit there. Oh, there. <laughs> I think that's the one from that last video, that cheeky one. I think I'm going to call him Barnaby. That's going to be Barnaby the dog. So I got Cedric the dog and Barnaby the dog. And I add uh, whatever you guys suggest as well. While I'm here, I might get some more sugar cane. Actually, no, I won't because that all should be growing by now. Yeah, it is. Yeah, so I'm going to finish off planting my cacti. Then I'm going to add in my wheat. And that should, that should be pretty much it for the farm, to be honest. I was contemplating building a big greenhouse over this area. And then I thought that, I don't know, it's so unoriginal and... There's, there's no real benefit from having a greenhouse. I suppose it can keep some of the googlies out, but apart from that... Oh, what am I doing? I don't even I don't even need to do that for this. 
because, uh, yeah, it doesn't need to be in a hole. I can just grow it straight out of the ground, which is easy. I mean, this, look, this looks pretty cool. It's a bit annoying that it's an odd end of cactuses. Right, let me think about this. Yeah, I was going to have... Actually, that's what I was going to do. I was going to have a fence down the middle and then wheat on either side of the fence. So, I don't believe I have any fence on me. I don't. Gonna make, I'm probably going to make too much. I always end up making too much. And you should never really worry about making too much of one thing because like, you can you can use it eventually anyway for something else, even if you don't use it now. I've got actually just a, like a chest full of built things. So like, say if I do make too many uh, like fence, fence pieces now, I can just sort of use them for something else later. Although I do generally forget to go back to it and just make more of it. So maybe that isn't the best thing. Yeah, so I'm going to have a, have a row of fences here, and then either side of that, I'm just going to be growing some wheat. And you actually need to use a hoe to make wheat, because um, a man shouldn't really do it. Oh, <laughs> only no joking. Yeah, you need to use the, the gardening tool, uh, a hoe, in order to, um, like, prepare the ground or whatever it is. And this looks a bit weird, actually. I might trim this back a little bit. I also need to add some stairs going down there. Right, I'm only going to do one row because I am conscious of time and if I'm going to get these achievements done uh, I don't want to be I don't need to get bored and you know yeah, I know there's a lot of people that would take like oh god what what does that do I thought a hoe prepares the ground what is it is it huh maybe not then I swear that I swear, like, I've never used a hoe before um, right I'll try just chucking some uh, some seeds down then. Okay, well, it won't let me chuck seeds down. Maybe, maybe the the dirt that it picks up is a special kind of dirt. Um, it doesn't need to be near water, does it? Okay, I'm not actually sure how hose work, to be honest, because. Oh, okay. Yeah, you've got to use the left stick, basically. I've been using the right stick and just destroying the ground. I'm sorry, I should really do my research before I go straight into these videos. Okay, oh, and then standing on the ground ruined them again. Puts them back to normal. Okay. See, about this, I'm learning. It's part of a learning progress. If you wanted to watch a really experienced Minecrafter and get a load of tricks and, like, tips and stuff, uh, you wouldn't be watching my videos because I plank random... Uh, fences through my crops. Yeah, and I, I got all these these seeds, by the way, the same way I get got roses and stuff. Just throw down a load of bone meal, and then um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then you get a uh, tall grass will grow, and from the tall grass, if you destroy that, you about probably about twenty percent of the time you get like a pile of seeds, and then yeah. I get a nice crop of wheat growing here. Gardening with Stampy Longnose. A very green-fingered episode here. A lot of planting and doing stuff in gardens. And fucking sheep are almost as bad as my dogs. <laughs> oh, I'll add this last one. There we go. This is my farm almost finished. I mean, I'm going to do another row of wheat on that side. To be honest, I might don't even have to, to be honest. I've got two rows here, either side of the fence. I might do something else here. I might grow through trees or just put some flowers or something else there. I'll decide in a later video. Okay, so now I'm going to quickly run and try and get these achievements. So, okay, I need to make a cake. So I need to milk a cow, which is something I've never done before. So I need to find a cow first, I guess. I also need to put a saddle on a pig and ride that around. So it's very dependent on animals. Is this a, is that a wild dog? No, this is just one that... Okay, you can stay because you're being good. You're just staying there. You're not getting in my way. You're, you, you can be there. Also, oh, I need to catch a fish as well. So I need to make a fishing rod. What do I need to make that? Uh, some sticks and some string. <laughs> I do feel bad. I do feel bad about leaving dogs just sitting all around the place. Shouldn't be so naughty. You shouldn't be so stupid and run into cactuses either. <laughs> it's your own fault. I have a fishing rod. Right, I've, I've been fishing before, but only in the training level, and I didn't actually catch anything. Which sucked, so hopefully I have some better luck this time. I'm gonna go fish at the front of the house because hopefully I can 
<laughs> Actually, no, I just fish in here. Can you just cast off anywhere? <laughs> Let's see if I can catch a dog. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Well, I caught one. <laughs> sit down. Oh, no. Oh, God. That's, that's one way to make a dog sit down. Oh, they're, they're all whimpering at me now. Once again, proving I'm the worst dog owner. And it's getting dark. Right, can I quickly catch a fish before it gets dark? That's the question. To the answer of which will probably be no. Alright, I'll give it ten seconds. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Hurry up, it's getting dark. Five. Quickly, four. Come on, three. Do it. Two. One. Give me a fish. Nope, missed your chance. Right. To, to the bed. Hopefully it will uh, let me sleep. Well, hopefully I won't get woken up. <laughs> look at that! <laughs> you look in your infantry, you're just there uh, lying sideways. Oh, my dogs are whimpering at me again. I love I love that. <laughs> just an excuse to use redstone because I learned how to do it. And where the hell are all the animals? Normally I'm like battling to keep them off my land and now I can't see them anywhere. Here's quite a nice little fishing pool. Or is, that, or is that too shallow? I don't know if there's a a set depth it has to be for you, in order for you to catch fish. Oh, 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 I think I missed my chance then. Sorry, I was scratching my face. <laughs> Whoops. Once again, an itchy face has ruined my prospects of fish. I apologise for the mundanity of the activity I'm doing right now. I'm sure a lot of you would get bored fishing anyway, but watching someone doing it in a video game, Minecraft. Oh, got one. Have I got one? Did I get one? Did I get a fish? I don't think I did. I don't know if I'm doing it right. Like, I was just I was just watching for it to drop down, and when it dropped, I pressed left trigger. Was I too slow? I seemed pretty quick. Or do I have to wait for it to bob back up, then pull it back in? I am not sure. There we go. There's a fish. <laughs> Is anyone home? <laughs> oh, they're all moaning at me. Have I got any more pork chops? Oh, tell you what, I'd, I'd, I'd give one of them the fish, but I need it to get the achievement. Oh, and there's a... Is that a pig? Oh, no. <laughs> I always think I always think there's pigs in my garden, but it's just that massive heart. Right. How do I cook a fish then? Oh, I need to put it in here, don't I? Here we go. Raw fish. How long is it going to take? Not very long at all. So I will wait. Fish me a dish. Cooked fish. Get ready for the achievement. Yum, 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 yum. Ah, oh, what? I don't even have notifications on. That's why. <laughs> I got, okay, believe me, I would have just got the achievement there. Right, while I'm here, I might as well milk this cow. And then I can bake a cake. Thank you, cow. Actually, I think I need a few buckets of milk. I hope they don't take the bucket as well. I think <laughs> I'm going to milk this cow for all it's worth. I'm going to take all the milk until there's dairy any left. Woohoo! Milk these jokes as well. Yeah, it's time to move on. Okay, let's make a cake then. So what is everything I need? I need... Okay, I got my milk. I need sugar, eggs, and wheat, I believe. Right, so I can go get some wheat, because that should have grown. I think this is all going to fit into place quite nicely. Everything's going to be quite nicely synchronised. No, it's not. Oh, no, here's some wheat. Here's some wheat. Is it grown? Oh, no, is it? Is that? No, it's not grown yet. Oh, and I just stand on my crops. That's a good idea. Right, so do I have everything else? Okay, I've got an egg. Right, what's everything I needed again? I need egg, sugar, and wheat. I might actually have some wheat stored up in here from somewhere or other. Sugar, sapling, sapling. No, I don't. Right, it should grow pretty soon. If not, I could shove some bone meal on there and speed up proceedings. Right, well, I've got my eggs. 
I need to make actual sugar. I believe I use sugar cane on a crafting table to make sugar. There we go. I got some sugar. Can I only make one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I only took one sugar cane. That's why. I also need to make some mushroom stew. I don't think I've ever made that. I remember I got so excited when looking at everything you can make. Like, oh, mushroom stew. It just seems like a really random thing to be able to create. Okay, so all I need is that wheat. So if I get some bone meal, which should be in here, maybe? Yeah. I should be able to speed up the process of the wheat growing. If it hasn't grown already. I've got quite a nice view now. A nice scenic green view. Stampy's love garden. Is that dog all right? Are you okay down there? <laughs> he's a, he kind of answered me by jumping up and down. He's happy. I think he's just trying to stay well behaved because he saw me telling off all of the other dogs. Right, so let's let's speed up some of these. Got way too much milk. Careful, careful of that cactus. Yeah, you see it? You see that cactus? Don't go into it. <laughs> As if that wasn't going to happen. As if he wasn't going to dive straight into it. Here we go. <laughs> I hope that didn't prickle the uh, the sheep there. I think I just punch it. There we go. Yeah, and it also gives you back seeds as well once you do it. I will go and replant there in a minute, don't you worry. But <laughs> I can see that dog whimpering. <laughs> it's your own bloody fault. Here he is. Sit, sit there, sit there by yourself and think about what you've done. Let's make cake. Right, I'm actually, I'm going to turn notifications on for this. Just so, because I haven't had, because I always play with notifications off because um, when I'm recording, I don't want popping up saying that people are online and sending me messages and stuff. So I haven't heard this sound in so long. It's going to be so rewarding. Oh, why won't it let me do it? Where's my milk gone? Where's my milk gone? I've lost my milk. Oh, I was so looking forward to that. Oh, no, I got excited then, think I was getting an achievement. Have I thrown my milk somewhere? What's happened here? Right, I've got another bucket. Oh, I made a cake. Oh, I already made it. Oh, okay. Well, I missed out on the achievement sound. I don't think there's any other achievements I can do now, because I think the only other one I could do was the uh, the riding a pig. Yeah. And the minecart one. Oh, well. Um, I'm going to share out my cake with all my doggy friends. <laughs> but... Uh, in terms of this video, I think that's about the end of what I can do. So check out a link in the description if you want to see the next episode of Stampy in Minecraft. As I say, this is the end of this video. Cheers for watching and I will see you later.